Let's solve the following example. I have two fractions, one half plus four over five. Remember, anytime we want to add fractions, we have to make sure that we are going to have common denominator. In this case, we have different denominators. First fraction has two in the denominator, and the second one has five. Now, please notice that two is the prime number, and 5 is the prime number. Remember that the prime numbers are the numbers which we can divide by 1 or by itself only. The examples of the prime numbers are 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, okay, and so on. Now, anytime we have prime numbers in the denominator, so we have 2 and 5. If you want to find a common denominator, simply multiply them together. Okay? So I have 1 over 2 and we have 4 over 5. If you want to find LCD. So 2 times 5 gives me 10. The question is, by what number I have to multiply 5 to get 10? I have to multiply by 2. Whatever I did in the denominator, I have to do the same operation in the numerator, so I have to multiply by 2. 4 times 2 gives me 8. By what number I have to multiply 2 to get 10? I have to multiply by 5. Whatever I did in the denominator, I have to do also in the numerator. 1 times 5 is I found the equivalent fractions to the fractions in my problem. I have 5 over 10 plus 8 over 10. Okay? I have common denominator. If I have common denominator, I can add these two fractions. Remember, the denominator will always stay the same. And 5 plus 8 is 13. 13. 13 over 10. This is the example of the improper fraction. Improper fraction I'm going to change to the mixed number. Simply, I have to divide 13 by 10. How many times 10 goes into 13? 1. 1 times 10 gives me 10. Subtract. 13 minus 10 gives me 3. My answer is 1 and 3 over 10. Where top number will go always to the front, remainder will go to the numerator, and the divisor will go to the denominator. So, my answer is 1 and 3 over 10. This is the solution.